turn and head towards the final open ditch. And out in the lead, it is Bollett Lee in the centre for Charlie Hammond has moved through to press, do you think? Rose of Arcadia just looks to explore the inside. The rider's just lost the irons around the turn, which might explain that rather awkward passage. And he's right on terms, Rose of Arcadia. Swing complete still there as well. Two to take. And all four in with a chance. As on the left-hand side, Rose of Arcadia for Freddie Gingell has the lead. And that lead's grown to three lengths over, do you think? Who was violently out to the right there. So heading down towards the last. Rose of Arcadia, Freddie Gingell trying trying to retain his balance with no irons, but he's coming clear, and this is the final obstacle. Rose of Arcadia is over safely. About eight lengths back to the dueling second places, do you think, and Bollett Lee. Swing and Fleet was pulled up before the last, but up towards the line, Rose of Arcadia is coming right away in the closing stages, and despite being a rather uncomfortable victory, it will be win number six in the career of Freddie Gingell, who wins for Joe Tudor. First off, well done. Thank Secondly, you. what happened on the bend? Oh, I think so. We've just we've gone up, gone up upside Aiden, and she just drifted in. We just, we just bumped, like bumped his out like back end, and I've lost my stirrup. Man, before I take the other one out, just to balance myself really, and the jump the last three. In the end, all right. But if, if I dare say, if 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 if, if we got one wrong, it might it might be a different story. But your dad would tell me right. Will Bidet used to let you ride without any irons. Yeah, he did. I remember on the babies down at Wills, he said, "I oh, take." Well, one day actually, my iron snapped. And he said, "I'll oh, take the other one out and perhaps like that." So that actually has a, has, a, has come in a, in a good. Pr in, Good practice in the end, and, and and she goes really well for you this mare. Yeah, she does. Like, oh, so one, I won two of her pointing, point to point last season, two two really nice races, and she won it first time out at Chepstow with me, and she's a lovely mare, and I'm lovely. I'm very very thankful for Jeff and the owners to to keep putting me on. And, yeah, and, and you must be enjoying riding against professionals now, aren't you? Yeah, yeah I am. Like, I'm only 16, but my, most people say I'm still young, but obviously I'm still learning, sort of thing. And turn 17 soon, so hopefully, yeah, keep going. Like. I thought you might be a bit squeaky your voice in this interview, but you seem all right. No, no, I seem all right. I seem all right at the moment. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully, be right. Well done. Thank